uptime coma it is a fancy self-hosted monitoring tool you can monitor your important application websites and network connected devices in this video i am going to show you how you can install uptime kuma very easily i use proxmox as a hypervisor and install debian container on it and i also install docker and install uptime kuma on it for those who already don't know that how to use uptime kuma or what it is for them i'm just adding a quick overview on the description it actually monitor http and https website tcp ports and dns records and uh, based on your uptime of each of the services or the network connected devices it can send you notification via email telegram slack sms and so on actually it can support up to 90 plus notification services and it also support multiple languages i will follow the docker installation method these commands i will list on the video description so you don't have to copy it from here they have detailed guide on their github project page this installation will take a while so you can do a fast forward if you wish to Once it is installed, you can browse using the host IP and the port number is 3001. I am setting a password and uh, first time login is like this. This is your home screen. Now I have to add a monitor. So I'm going to monitor my host machine where I install uptime coma. So the method I choose is the ping method. I'm putting my host IP address here. And here you can see that every 60 seconds it is going to send the heartbeat. So you can change the value if you wish that it is needed for you. I'm adding a level. Now once I save it, I can see the first heartbeat is gone and it found it is on. So here is the settings. I am not going to describe the notification setup, uh, but it's pretty straightforward and there is a lot of options you can set at the notifications. On the appearance, you can set a dark mood, which is really very beautiful. Here you can set 2FA as well. Now I'm going to monitor my website, my personal blog. Here I choose the HTTPS.
and the level that's it save the first heartbeat gone and uh, the website is up that's it i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much